how's it going? I'm Joe, and today we're going to talk about one uh, easy exercise to uh, make you hit a lot harder. Uh, this is going to go over one, and I'll actually give you a couple. I'm going to give you maybe more than one uh, to help you out. Uh, so let me give you a little bit about my background. I uh, used to do Taekwondo, then I went on to Kung Fu, and uh, I still practice a little bit of those. I, I attribute a lot of my success to those traditional martial arts. Um, now I do Thai boxing, and I teach at a traditional American kickboxing school currently. Um, so I this whole, this whole channel is going to be dedicated to striking, you know, punching, kicking, uh, shin strikes, uh, elbows, knees, all of that with any sport. You know, we're talking about boxing, kickboxing, MMA, striking, um, and so on. So if you like any of that stuff, do me a huge favor. Please hit that subscribe button and click that bell icon so you have information immediately when I post it. Uh, the postings, I'm still trying to figure out how often I'm going to post, but this stuff seems fun. I like talking, and these are largely discussion videos. I'm going to be showing a, lot, a series of still images because I want to not bore you to death. Uh, you know, to have something on the screen, otherwise, be kind of a blank, staring at a blank screen, right? It'd be kind of silly. Uh, so let's get into this one exercise. Uh, so this is super easy and I, I recommend it to anyone else and, and you can do it, you can incorporate it, right? It's easier to incorporate, incorporate it into something you're already doing. So if you are practicing striking, I'm going to assume you're already, uh, you're already uh, kind of working out. Here's an easy one. The easiest one would be uh, do push-ups on your knuckles. If you're doing regular style push-ups, that's absolutely great. I commend you. I do it too. I love it. it feels great, right? Your back or your chest or your arms or whatever. Uh, you know, depending on how wide you put your push-ups. Uh, do them on your knuckles. Your knuckles, it will, your weight will push down on your knuckles and it will kind of strengthen your knuckles. That is a big part of punching is how hard your hand is as well. My dog is barking and it is annoying. Um, I'm just going to try to ignore it. Hopefully you can't hear it. Uh, anyways, here's another one, uh, and I've talked about this in another video. Strengthen your uh, okay. So I, I go over three things, right? When you want to strengthen your hand, uh, you want to strengthen your hand so you can hit harder with it, right? There's a difference between hitting uh, something with a big hammer or like a ball peen hammer. Uh, you want the the tool that you're using is so important because it is susceptible to break. So you do want to take these precautions. One, like I said, strengthen your knuckles. Another way to strengthen your knuckles, grab a smooth stone, hit your knuckles against it. Keep it next to you in the car, keep it next to you at your desk. Smack it every now and then in the back of your knuckles, give it like some small back fist, punch into it lightly. Don't break your hand, <laughs> you don't have the bat. Uh, that's a good one. Another one, strengthen the muscles within your hand. The muscles within your hand keep all the bones together, keep that thing together, so you know all that stuff, the ligaments. How do you strengthen that? Easy. Uh, your grip strength needs to increase. Uh, you can grab this contraption, which I still don't know the name of, I have it in my car. You just practice your grip every now and then. You keep it in your car. You're driving. It's it's extra. It's not a big deal. Um, it's super it's super simple. You improve as you're driving. Uh, well, don't uh, don't get dangerous with it. Uh, another one: big buckets of sand. Stick your hands in there and and squeeze. Get in there. Crunch your hand, and that'll incre increase the muscularity in your hand. It will increase your grip strength. Hanging from a bar is another one as well. If you go to a gym and they just have a, an area to hang or do pull-ups, try hanging there for uh, maybe 30 to 40 seconds. <coughs> Excuse me, I coughed. <coughs> I don't want to cough in the mic, sorry. <coughs> Pardon me. Okay, I'll edit that out, maybe. Um, yeah, I would say grab the uh, bar and just hang there for a little bit. See how long you can do that. Uh, if you want to majorly increase your strength, I would say try uh, your grip strength. Try uh, climbing. That's a big one. Uh, indoor mountain climbing is a great one. Um, but yeah, you don't have to do all that. I'm just throwing everything out there. Uh, what else? Uh, your wrist. That's a big one. Increase your wrist strength by doing hammer holds. Uh, I'm, you know, you hold a hammer like a sledgehammer way at the end of it and really increase your grip strength. By the way, doing those push-ups will strength, strengthen your uh, your wrist as well. So anyways, that's too much information. I just wanted to throw everything out there and that you could use it. Um, I, it's, just, it's just these are things that really help my students out and I want you to benefit from them. Uh, if you benefit, if you, sorry, I'm tongue tied here. If you benefited from any of these, if you think something of these, you, some of these you want to try, 
do me a huge favor comment below say hi to me we'll talk uh you know hit me with a like uh subscribe to the channel any of that stuff and that's pretty much the end of the video end of this discussion uh do you guys have any good uh tips on strengthening your punch maybe there's something i never heard about let's talk about it um the other thing is if you want a knockout punch the best thing to do would be to download my free report i'm gonna have a free report right here in the description below look below there's a description i'm gonna have a free report on how to have a knockout punch because it's more than just hitting it's more about your body wear on someone you're hitting them as well that matters because the hardest bone is what one of the hardest bones right in the skull is the forehead you can break your hand on that sometimes you don't want to do that you don't want to hit someone in the forehead you could but it'd be optimal to hit them somewhere else so that kind of stuff i will uh, like touch on in the report download that and i will talk to you in the next video see you later guys